The Iron Squad Competition is a four-day long event that tests 1st Armored Division squads on a variety of tasks and skills that embody the total soldier concept. Those squads rely on NCOs to lead by example, especially on the obstacle course. Staff Sergeant Rashnik Edmund, a Radio Retrans Supervisor, took the competition as an opportunity to show her squad what it means to be an NCO. Uh, we're the backbone of the Army, so by being that leader, as you see me uh, motivating them, cheering them on, I'm, I'm that backbone. Even if they fall down, I'm there to support them and bring them back up. So to be part of that, to be part of that core, it means, it means a lot to me. Um, I'm super proud for them. Uh, this is the first time that they're able to do a competition at this level, and I've done so many throughout my career, and it's great that they're able to get this spotlight. Specialist Jason Martinez, a signal support system specialist in Edmund's squad, speaks to her leadership ability and how she is setting a great example for him as a future NCO. Sergeant Edmonds has tons of experience as a leader. She's a great mentor. Her leadership skills, there's no question in them. She has proven herself time and time again. If you see us during the obstacle course, I was there to support her soldiers to make sure no matter what we do, we do it correctly, make sure we finish strong, and I just have to show the standard. So me as someone who's gonna be a future NCO, I gotta make sure uh, that when it's time to work, it's time to work, and when it's time to play, it's time to play. Reporting from Fort Bliss, Texas, I'm Army Sergeant David Cordova.